Hello Leos. This is your reading for June. This reading is for my Leos. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. <clears throat> Let's see what's going on with you guys in the month of June. Hopefully some good shit is going on for you. Let's see. Please show me messages for Leos. What's going on with Leos? Please show me what's going on with Leos. Seven of Wands figure. There's something that you feel like you need to defend. Whether it's yourself, your beliefs, someone else. But you feel like you need to stand up for what it is that you believe here. That is your card. What is crossing Leos? It's crossing Leos. Something wanted to jump out there. It's crossing Leos. Two of Swords. Hmm. What's challenging you is there's something that you're not seeing. You have this blindfold on and you're not really allowing yourself to see the full extent of what is going on. Okay? Um, I do feel like some of you may be a little uh, hyper vigilant. Um, you may feel attacked, but there's really not an attack going on. There's something here that you're not seeing. Open your eyes, open your heart, open your mind, guys, okay? That's Libra energy. I feel like some of you may be judging a situation a little too harshly. What is the underlying issue here for Leo's? Two of Pentacles. Now we're presented with two twos. That is all about a decision and um, doing the right thing. Making the most of what it is that you have. So I feel like the underlying issue or the reason why you're here and in defense mode is because there's something that you're unsure about. Is making you a little off balanced I feel here this is Capricorn energy could be money could be finances um, that's having you you know have you feeling this way okay <clears throat> let's see what was going on in the recent past for Leo's recent past for Leo's five of cups feeling hurt I feel like somebody hurt your feelings and there's something that you feel uh, regret surrounding. Maybe you shouldn't have been vulnerable in a certain situation. So now you're hyper vigilant and you're going to like the far left and not allowing yourself to extend yourself emotionally at all. You know, there's something that is bothering you and it threw you off. Something has thrown you off here. We have cups here and we have um, pentacles here. So maybe it's the fact that you have a lot on your plate. Um, that things are not as stable as you would like for them to be. A relationship is not as stable as you would like for it to be. And I feel you guys have been very hurt. Feeling very like... Um, all is lost here. Very hurt feelings. Scorpio energy there. Crowning thoughts for Leo's. Oh, the devil. Devil has been showing its ugly face um, in a couple of readings thus far. That is Capricorn energy. You have Capricorn in your mind and you have Capricorn energy in your foundation here. I feel like this is about um, your stability, your money, your work. Um, and, and I feel like you're working really hard to have this stability. And this could definitely be in reference to a job and or relationship but I feel like you guys are looking for stability you're looking for it and I feel that your feelings are hurt and I feel like this is more for a relationship though like your feelings are hurt and you're not going to allow someone to get you here again but there's something you're not seeing 
What's coming in for Leos? What's coming in for Leos? Ten of Swords here. This is having this overwhelming feeling of um, being stabbed in the back, feeling hurt, um, feeling like there's a lot of things that have been done to you that that you just want to be able to release and let go of. Um, so there's there's something that you're holding on to, I feel like, because you want to let go of it. But somebody has truly hurt you. Somebody that you feel like has hurt you time and time again. That feeling is revisiting you. This is Gemini energy here. But I feel like with this Two of Swords right smack dab in the middle of the Seven of Wands and the Ten of Swords is saying you have to make up your mind whether or not you're going to let this own you. You're going to let this hurt you. You're going to let this continue to impede your progress. It's time to let it go. Tens are endings. This, that's what this is saying. Okay. How is Leo viewing their situation? How is Leo viewing your situation? The Ten of Wands is a burden for sure. It weighs heavily on you. That Sagittarius energy. You're ready to start over. You're ready to do something different. You're ready to work your shit out. You're ready for stability. You're ready to stop feeling like, you know, all your balls are up in the air. You know, you're ready for some shit to land and stick. What is the influence here for Leo's? Six of Swords which is moving forward mentally letting go of things six of swords is always moving forward but it's moving forward but you still are hurt you've been through some shit you want to be able to release you want to be able to let go and move on Look at things for what they really are, how they really are, and releasing. You're carrying your hurt with you because you'll never forget it. But you really do want to move forward. I see that. But you, you still are carrying those swords behind you and in front of you here. I feel like somebody has let you down. And I feel like... It's probably more than one person you feel that has let you down. But there's somebody in particular, I feel like there's a lot of weight on your shoulders where this person is concerned. This is Aquarius energy here. <clears throat> Hopes or fears for Leo. Hopes or fears for Leo. Ace of Pentacles, there's that new beginning. That Pentacle is a start excuse me, of a stable foundation. It is something that you can hold on to. It is something that you can hang your hat on. It is something that you can build upon. And that is what you're looking for. That one thing that lets you know that you're on the right track. I feel like you want a solid relationship. And you want to know that from the jump. You want to know that you can depend on somebody. You want to know that this person wants to build something with you. You want to know that you are in the right job. And that this job is going to provide everything that you need. <clears throat> what is the overall outcome here for Leo's? Overall outcome for Leo's. Strong Capricorn energy, Aquarius energy, Gemini, Libra, Sagittarius, Scorpio energy here. Overall outcome for Leos. Nine of Wands. I like it. Because this is you being resilient. This is you want to continue. This is you not giving up on love. This is you not giving up on yourself. 
That's being strong as hell and doing what you need to do to get what you want. Okay? Again, Sagittarius energy. You're ready to pick up and move forward. You're resting. You're resting. I see you taking a, a breather from this warrior stance right here because here you've been through the battle. And you're taking, a t taking the time to rest and regroup so you can keep pushing forward. Okay? So that is what I have for you guys. And I'll be speaking with you soon.